Richmond Raceway, our home tonight, race number nine of the 2018 season. And we love the short tracks. We love the action here, and Richmond is a short track like no other. Kyle Busch is starting back in 30 seconds. That's good for us. We're going to see him charge to the front. Our car was pretty good in practice. We just tried to outsmart ourselves a little bit for qualifying. Qualifying on Friday, the crew chief may have made a small error. You know, we didn't have time to make a mock run. We only had three sets of tires for practice, and we didn't really know how many laps it was going to take for our tires to come in. Boogity, boogity, boogity! Let's go racing on this short track, boys! We started deep in the field, but we also felt like only one cycle on the tires was going to be way better than the other guys that had three cycles on their tires, and uh, we were going to be able to drive up through there somewhat, but I, was, I wasn't expecting to be able to drive up as far as we did that first run. Kyle Busch three, three wide. wide once again. Yikes! Now that was risky. He got by three cars in, in a straightaway. D17 here, making really good time. Just pace yourself for me. Kyle Busch has passed more than one car per lap. That's demoralizing to every car. The further forward he gets, they say, are you kidding me? Didn't he start 32nd? He's already up here passing me. It was pretty calm, slicing up through the field. You know, there was a couple moments where I was like three wide outside, and then there was a couple times where I was like three wide in the middle. I really got that kind of second lane rolling really early in the race. That was where my stuff really wanted to be and where it really worked good. And then as the race kind of kept going, my lines kind of changed with the racetrack and, and what was kind of happening. The little bit of tire advantage we had by virtue of only running two laps, uh, we really made quick time coming up through the pack. Joey Logano, he picks up the green checkered flag. Stage one complete, Joey Logano getting the win. Kyle Busch up to six. Kyle Busch now has taken third. As hard as Kyle Busch races, as hard as he drives, he knows his limits. He knows when he's pushing it too hard. And if I wanted to push the car on the short run, I could keep up with those guys past, uh, I think it was Logano, and then I was gonna go chase Kurt down and try to get to Kurt, and I was pushing kind of a little harder than I wanted to, and Boyer was keeping up with me, and it didn't seem like he was trying very hard to keep up with me. I let him go and tried to get back into the rhythm of trying to just run laps and try to save my tires and keep my rear tires underneath me. Those guys just started driving away and they kept driving away the whole time. Like it didn't matter how much I saved my stuff. Any chance that I that I tried to go for five laps, I could maintain with them or keep up with them. Never gained on them, but it really punished the tires and I would really fall back after that. Joey Logano is your stage two winner. Green flag waving again with 188 laps to go. 78 is the quickest right now. Martin Truex Jr., the leader by two seconds. Yeah, the 78 was definitely better than us. And um, so Adam was like, you know, what do you got going on? What's going on? And I was like, I want whatever he's got. Oh! oh Trouble Jamie Murray, Murray, Murray in hard in the wall. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Felt like it was kind of getting a little bit better as we were going. All right, pits are open. A little issue on the left side of that 78 pit stop. There's the race off pit road. Bush, Hamlin, Truex, three Toyotas. We'll be P1 when we go. Huge victory for us was uh, was getting off pit road first with my guys. Everybody on the team did an amazing job on the pit stops. They were fast all night long. These short runs are all about track position, and for them to execute when the pressure was on them speaks a lot of their preparation and uh, how good they really are. Get them rears good, dead into the box. Starts on you. And Kyle Busch pulls away. Put Kyle Busch out front. He's a hard man to chase down. Spinner up and into the wall. We'll have a caution. Ooh, boy. Three, two, one. Go. Kyle Busch is going to come out first. There on those last two, they were really fast. They got us out front. And, uh, you know, that was, that was what gave us the win. It was me being able to dictate the restarts. I think if there was somebody else in front of us, even if we were on the front row, we wouldn't have been able to dictate the restart. For me to be out front, for me to be leading the race, there was uh, there was no stopping us in those short runs. I think it says that we're really good about putting ourselves in position to win this year. You know, uh, the best car doesn't always win, and you have to have circumstances go your way sometimes. Six laps to go, green flag. Stay, stay. No good. Three wide behind you. Hit your marks here. Weller Dyson. Car in the wall, yeah. Stenhouse, turn three, caution. For this, take us over overtime. Yeah, so you're going up to the to the final restart and you already have like two laps on your tires. We just made just a blitz, you know, just a short run there. It's easy for the second place guy to buzz his tires. So when that happened, um, I just kind of focused up on my mirror and made sure that Chase wasn't too close to me. And uh, those guys were kind of racing a little bit for the first corner and I was able to get about a three car length gap and it seemed like I could keep that for the rest of the way. 
They'll never make it three peat from 32nd. Kyle Busch wins Richmond. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Awesome job, guys. Hell yeah. Just tried something different at the end of the race there uh, with a celebration, being able to go up in the grandstands with the fans, you know, gave some high fives, saw some kids, gave them some high fives, and and just wanted to uh, to, to say Rowdy Nation, appreciate you, and, and thanks, and fortunately I was able to get back to the racetrack. Yeah, don't forget that I'm, I'm a winner.